Area code 314. St. Louis, Missouri, on the banks of the Mississippi. It's here, on the way north from New Orleans, that the blues stayed for good. Sports and breweries, cereals and chemicals, and the arch, the gateway arch. Even today, when it's all finished, you look at it and you say to yourself, it couldn't be done. But there it is, the gateway to the west. 630 feet of stainless steel, just standing there tall and proud. And you can even ride up one side and down the other. That's a trip you really ought to take. But please, phone ahead for your room before you head for the arch. The park can be mighty cold. Area code 603. Mount Washington, New Hampshire. The highest mountain in the eastern part of the country. And it's the home of the world's first cog railway. Back in 1869, when the railway was first built, a lot of folks said it couldn't be done. But it was. Round trip up Mount Washington on the Cog Railway takes about two hours. The incline gets as steep as 37 degrees. It's an exciting and beautiful trip with lots to see and enjoy. You ought to try it. And when you do, keep in touch with home by phone. This weekend, and every weekend, you can telephone coast to coast for as little as 70 cents. It all began in Boston, 1876, with Alexander Graham Bell. The first telephone, the first switchboards, the first operators. Soon telephone lines to New York, to Chicago, and westward. And from San Francisco east. Lines from east and west meet in Utah. The year, 1915. The minimum rate on a call from New York to San Francisco in 1915, $20.70. Years pass, phone service expands, and long distance rates drop dramatically. The minimum rate for a coast to coast call by 1920 was $8.25, 1927, $5.50. 1940, $3. By 1963, $1 plus tax. Now, in 1970, the minimum is 70 cents plus tax, coast to coast, on calls you dial yourself on weekends. 70 cents for a three minute call from 8 a.m. to 11 p.m. Saturday, and 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Sunday. In 1915, $20.70. In 1970, 70 cents plus tax. They said it couldn't be done. But it was.